Hello, Prudential Sales Executives for our video message of the week. All right, we're on the third section in our four-part series on our unique value proposition, people, production, and culture. The fourth week, we're going to kind of sum it all up and really talk about purpose, but we'll get to that next week. For this week, we're going to key in on culture. Now, let me give you a couple insights on culture just to start off. Everyone on the planet is affected by the culture, by the environment that they choose. I guess a silly example would be is if you put yourself in a dark room for three, four hours in a day, all right, and just left yourself there to sit, you'd probably be affected in one way, shape, or form. Let me give you a better example. Let's say you created an environment where you hung around athletes all day long. You were always around people doing activities. You were always around people either running, swimming, gymnastics, whatever the case may be. Do you think you would be affected by that? You absolutely would. Now, don't assume it will push you one way or the next. We'll get to that. You would be affected. And so the key for you is, as it comes to cultures, what can you do to affect yourself positively and help you very effectively move towards the outcomes that you want to achieve? Does that make sense? Yes, it does. So keeping that in mind, we want to move towards these outcomes. How do we okay, place ourselves in a culture that helps us get there? Well, a couple aspects. One, you have to commit and know that you are the commander of the culture that you're in. Meaning, every day you can put yourself around productivity or you can choose to isolate yourself from productivity. If you place yourself in the mix of productivity, you will be more productive. Whatever that means for you. A lot of times people get overwhelmed and say, well, I don't want to take my business from here skyrocketing. It's not my goal. That's fine. We're not talking about that. What we're saying is this. When you place yourself around productive people, whatever that means to you, you will become more productive. When you choose the environments that you're in and when you choose the people that you hang out with and you associate with, it affects your business and it affects your life. All right, so how do we tie this back to our business? And how do we really drive more success for you utilizing this concept of culture? Well, by definition, when you place yourself in a more productive environment, guess what? You get more production, and what does that mean? That means more opportunities to earn, more opportunities to succeed. How many times have you made that additional call Okay, well, you know what? Everyone else was doing it and you did it and you didn't expect it and you got some business out of it. Or you got an appointment that really helped you in that area. Whatever the case may be is, is when you thrust yourself into that proper environment, that productive environment, you run into opportunities that were unexpected and would not have happened unless you made the choice to put yourself in that environment. The overall message today is, a message of participation and put yourself in those environments that basically float your boat. If you're someone who's competitive, then put yourself in that more competitive environment. If you're someone else who's dealing with kind of fear-based issues and you're saying, you know what, I'm really nervous about that, put yourself in those uh, environments where you can see others doing this on an ongoing basis and I promise you there will be someone in the audience that you will see or someone in your branch that you will see and you'll go you know what they're doing it and they're real comfortable doing it if they can do it I can do it have a great week everybody and we'll talk to you next week bye bye